put food on the table. Resources from this house to the houses of correction where those who are in prison will one day re-enter society with renewed optimism and revived spirit of fellowship. I pray, O oh Lord, that this blessed body of this house will help create the beloved house where all our brothers and sisters who have been enslaved, hated, lynched, denied, excluded, jailed, persecuted, raped, can sit at the same table of freedom, faith, and love, regardless of race, religion, or identity, and eat from the plate of peace, and eat from the plate of progress, and eat from the plate of reconciliation, and eat from the plate of reparations. And one day, Lord, that we will sing with harmonic justice when we all get together. What a day of rejoicing that will be. When we all get together, we can sing and shout the victory. I ask these prayers in the God we serve. Let this blessed house say, free at last. Free at last. Let this blessed house say, free at, last. free at last. Let this blessed house say, thank God Almighty. Thank God Almighty. We're free at last. Amen, amen. Amen, amen. Today is my first year um, state rep for Dorchester and Roxbury. Um, my little guy was more excited. He woke me up and said, it's time to go to the state house and raise the flag. So I'm happy to be here today. One day is hardly enough to memorialize the travesty of slavery in the United States. But the purpose of Juneteenth is not to memorialize what has happened, but to celebrate its absence. On the day we rejoice in the name of true freedom, we recount, we recount the lives that's lost in its journey to achieve it. Many of us whose ancestors endured the hardship that we reflect on today still wear the burden of our bloody history from centuries ago, like having the last name Worrell, an old English name from Shire or Yorkshire's from the United Kingdom. I've always known what it's meant. And though the origins were stolen from my father and his father, we have the opportunity to plant our own. Agora está com a palavra a governadora do estado de Massachusetts. Vou fazer aproximar mais um pouco aqui para fazer uma imagem dela. We know that Juneteenth is a day that marks the resilience, the historic resilience, the strength, the faith, the joy of the black community. It represents the strength through which this community moves our nation forward today. We're proud that Juneteenth has deep roots here in Massachusetts and fun laid out. It's also a history that has been Nurtured and cherished. The most shaken America has been since the civil rights we saw the dogs, the water, which moved the civil rights. Now, Juneteenth Emancipation Proclamation of 1864. Now, to June of 1860. And the renegades, and they're still renegades, and those folks are all the folks from the Union. Esse prédio aqui é a casa do estado de Massachusetts é uma casa pública do governo do estado de Massachusetts
E aqui está havendo uma solenidade, porque no dia 19 de junho, o dia 19 de junho é um feriado local nos Estados Unidos e comemora até alguma coisa a ver com a libertação dos escravos. Então, há pouco tempo, Deus, esse feriado nacional no dia 19 de junho. E aqui uma solenidade em frente à Casa do Estado de Massachusetts, onde pessoas estão se revezando na palavra ali em frente ao portão. Inclusive, no início, começou com a oração e agora a solenidade está prosseguindo. Esta imagem é da casa do estado de Massachusetts, aqui nos Estados Unidos.